Hey guys, so here's another quick video on Sasha's Sound Lab. A lot of people are asking questions about how to assign your MIDI controller to parameters inside of Sasha's Sound Lab in the contact player. So let me show you how that works. Now when you uh, bring in an instrument here, if you open this window here, obviously you're seeing that um, none of the parameters show. What you want to do is you want to um, you want to group this track. So on a Mac, you're going to hit Command G or Control G if you're on a PC. That'll open up your macros, and you're going to want to hit Configure here. And now what you want to do in here is go to Auto, right there. Disregard the 000 and start with 001, and then you just highlight and drag each parameter to whatever knob or control you'd like, like so. And as you can see down here, they show up for you to go ahead and use and assign. So now we'll just turn off configure, come up to MIDI, and we'll go ahead and assign this here to a knob, another knob, okay, easy, turn that off, and now you're able, as you can see here, you're able to completely control each of your deals here in the contact player, and also they're all going to show up here so you can draw in or automate each thing in the arrange window as well. So I hope that clears things up and uh, lets you know that, yes, you can assign your MIDI to this instrument. All right, have a good one.